Welcome to Burger King, where you can have it your way. Ha <laughs> ha! Okay, in all seriousness, though, welcome back to Splatfest with Klaus. Yeah, boy! Day? Oh my god, that is ridiculous. Let's, let's start the Splatfest before I embarrass myself even further. <laughs> Alright. Here we are with a Big Mac and a Whopper and... <laughs> my girlfriend's name in the Splatfest. Which I will display my reaction to now. Hold it! Okay, interrupting the video with some post commentary. The reaction will not be shown in this video because guess what happened? The reaction didn't record. What the fuck, Camtasia recorder? Oh my fucking god. Ugh. I swear, Camtasia recorder, you've been fucking me over for a while. I'm gonna be. Switching over to a new screen recorder. Sorry, Camtasia recorder, but you fucked up. And that's pretty much the end of that. <laughs> I love how she went with Whopper there. Like in, in you may notice in the um, reaction, I said Whooper. <laughs> I don't know why I had Pokemon on the mind. But anyways. Here we go. It's kind of disappointing I can't go all octoling in these uh, Splatfest battles, but oh well. Gotta be wearing your Splatfest tee. <laughs> anyway, we are here up against the pizza pie, pizza pie, pizza pie. Come and get your fresh pizza at Pizza Hut and Domino's and well, my local pizza place, which is Stonefire Pizza, best pizza I've ever had, by the way. Uh, oh, you fucking... Oh, I hate when these barriers are put up. So annoying. Killer boy, you are such a troll. You are a troll. Am I going to say that to everyone who uses the Splattershot Jr.? Probably. Oh. I guess... Okay. Uh, I can't read that very well. And I don't care to. All I know is I gotta fight the Joker. <laughs> well, okay, I'm sorry, but it's it's green. I can not help it. Actually, no, this isn't the Joker. This is Pesto Pasta. No, not Pesto Pasta. Pits. Pesto Pizza. Damn it. Uh, I was playing this before, and when I came up with the joke, I did the exact same thing. So it's twice. I accidentally said pesto pasta, not pesto pizza. I actually never had pesto pizza, but it's good. I'm gonna probably get one next time I go out for pizza. <laughs> okay, enough about me, enough more about the game. I okay. I'm I'm on Team Burger in case you couldn't tell. But I feel like I'm betraying pizza. Just and I gotta be honest here. And this might piss some people off, but you know what? I don't really care. I'll speak my mind, no matter what the topic is, no matter just who disagrees with me or what. I'm, I'm just going to speak my mind. I want pizza to win. Because I think this will push the entire point of Splatfest. Like, okay, do you like this more? Just vote for whatever you have a personal preference to. It's always, uh, am I on the winning side? And before um, my... Ninja Pirates vs Ninja. It's am I on the more popular side? No, it's pick what you like better. If you like option A more, pick option A. If you like option B more, pick option B. That's really what Splatfest is all about. That's what I feel Splatfest should be. But nobody's doing that. It's just everyone just cares about winning the Splatfest, which is kind of dumb to me. But, uh, oh well. Okay, I, I just had to get that off my chest.
And uh, speaking of things I want to get off my chest, um, there is actually a new stage that's maybe you've seen it already, Mahi Mahi Resort. It's a pretty good stage, actually. It's this one that really just goes for the um, okay, um, just I don't know, it's just it's different from most other stages, which is why I like it so much. And, oh my god, am I really gonna get disconnected here? <clears throat> Fuck, I knew it. Too predictable. Ugh, be right back for match two. Lucius and King! Cause no evil doer is a match for the king! Uh Salt spray I almost said wig. <laughs> wow, can I stop but I am probably not. <clears throat> oh whatever. Just go Okay, there's someone already over that way. That's fine, that's fine. Like, I know I really don't care at this point. Woo! Look at me, take your tough! Do da, do da! Wait, what? What was that? What does Blackfest has to have to do with show tunes? Um, I'm just gonna be all around random this time around. <laughs> Ooh, King has burned the skull bandana, which is fantastic! Best head accessory visually, I, w I think. Well, just my opinion. But I like a lot of the, um, I like all the, I like a lot of the new gear. It's pretty sweet. Totally high tech the cat! I don't know, like I said, I'm just being super weirdo. Super weirdo mode, activate! Kill rainy mode! Clean up the pesto sauce! Because we're having a high lack of it in our um, pizza parlor, yes. By pesto with ketchup! Oh, sorry, that's key sauce. Yes, I'm going back to key sauce. And I just have so many jokes for this, for this stuff. Okay, anyone around here? Ah! Ah! Uh, I was gonna drink you with key sauce, put you on a burger, and... Oh, okay, that just sounds kind of gruesome. <laughs> Whatever. I gotta say, this is... This Lapis is my second favorite of the bunch. I say second favorite because... Well, let's be honest, you can't top art versus science. Right over here, and hey, my fir my first Burger King customer. Here, has cheese, have cheese sauce. There you go. Thank you for stopping at Jackass in the Box. Hope to see you again at McDonald's. <laughs> Don't ask why I call it Jackass in a Box. <laughs> oh, oh. All right, enjoy that cheese stuffed crust pizza. By the way, is it weird that I'm on Team Burger and I want pizza to win? It kind of is, I think. Well, see, and match three is my second weapon of choice. Museum Dolphin Sino! Sorry, I had a wolf out there. But yeah, Museum Dolphin Sino! 
the best stage in the game. Yeah, so many cool art exhibits around here. It's like, it's fantastic. Murray, how can you not like this music? Okay, I know you're more science, but come on, you gotta appreciate the arts. The Monado arts. Okay, he's hey. <laughs> Any big time Xenoblade fans and saw that coming. <laughs> In all seriousness, though, on the day of the Splatfest starting, Xenoblade Chronicles X came out, and I just got to, I love the hell out of it. It's awesome. Didn't betray my expectations whatsoever. I love it. And easy to play fans. You should fix this game up. Okay, I'm, I'm sorry I unleashed a major fanboy moment there, but I love it. Okay, now on to my um, thoughts on um, Mahi Mahi Resort. It's a really nice stage. It's a bit different from the rest. It's got some like split of grounds, which is really nice. I say it's really nice because it's like, Okay, um, I really just gotta focus on my skill here, like, um, yeah, it's, that, that's the thing, it's more skill focused on the first minute and a half of this, but more ground opens up to you as a water drops down, that's really nice, and I just gotta address some of the, um, uh, I get, not just some of the, um, but some some people don't like it nearly as much, and I don't understand why that is. I don't get why some people just don't like the stage. Like this is beyond my realm of understanding. Because uh, somebody even went as far as to um, nitpick the um, stage say it's a bad stage purely because of the floor. I'm I'm sorry, but that's kind of a dumb thing to judge, and it's entire stage on just because it's visually um just because something's not good visually you think it's a, you think the entire stage is bad i'm sorry that's not a good reason for like for the second stage that's just cherry picking sorry not cherry picking that was a bad that's a bad phrase to use nitpicking i'm sorry and i, I don't care what anybody says i just i find something that kind of cheeses me a little bit and I, I just have to speak my mind on it that's just the thing. I'm very open when it comes to speaking my mind. I like it tough. I'm sorry, that's just how I am. Okay. But enough about that. Let's just enjoy some art! <laughs> okay. I actually I unintentionally made a, um, a pirate joke out of that. Like, one of the best things here is a Super Sea Snail exhibit. It's, uh... Risky Boots, I'm sorry you went with Team Ninja. I should have sided with you, especially during my Shantae uh, LP. But at the very least, Risky Boots, you can laugh at the ninjas because you reign victorious! How often can you say that besides Shantae and the Pirate's Curse? <laughs> I mean, really, how often can you say, Hey, I'm a victorious! Hmm. That was Alicia. That has a, um, victorious vibe to it. For some reason, I don't know. Otoshi God! It's Sonic! Okay, I'm not as big of a Sonic fan as I am a Mario fan. That's cool. Oh, I get to show up more exhibits here. Squid Baron, I really, I wish you were here to see this. You would love this museum. I mean, check out the Squid Fountain. That is the cream of the crop when it comes to this museum. Like... Easily one of the best details in this, um, stage. And I'm sure you'll agree with me, Squid Baron. <laughs> that is of an armpit. <laughs> that is of someone actually me that I don't actually put each other as. Oh, well. Whoa, uh, I couldn't see that missile there. <laughs> yes, my forever name for that would be the missile. Hey, I'm second to one name. 
Watch that. <laughs> Watch that come to a screeching halt next ma next match. Where you start calling it the. Yeah. I'm actually proud of myself. There's um, Inkling girl statue. It's right over there, sitting on a um, log by the looks of it. This is just. This is the best. The, it's visually appealing. It's got quite a bit of strategy possibilities to it with the rotating um, obstacles. What's not to love on the stage? It's awesome and big time fan. Okay, if you're a fan of art, you will love this. Team Bugger! And it's got like a cat face to it. Okay. <laughs> I'll, I'll roll with it. Now it's not to watch the um, jelly roller or something stupid like that. Oh! Come here, come here, come here, come here. Yeah! Take that, Sonic! You are not the fastest thing alive! Haha! <laughs> you couldn't even outrun my Kraken. Actually, um... I've heard some people say that Mario might actually be faster than Sonic on the grounds that he can stop on a bullet. That Sonic's speed itself is just an illusion. But, and as I it was Mario's speed that was an illusion, excuse me. This is even brought to um, light by the game Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games, which I don't care for too much. Yeah, sue me. I don't like Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games. Okay, uh, oh, uh, I didn't have mine, I, I didn't have my own Kraken available, otherwise I would have countered that, like, hey, battle of the century, Kraken versus Kraken, place your bets, no, place your bets for the Kraken, no, <laughs> uh, I've been doing that impression all day. It's too fun. How can I not? Everyone head for the copper. Okay, that's enough of that. Well, I'll see you all back here with my final weapon of choice. Yes, I have a ridiculous amount of story rate cash. Now that stuff has been co coming up in the shop and I've been playing a lot. <clears throat> I see you notice my um weapon was blood right there. Ooh, battle number five. We're gonna relax with some jazz. I don't know why I did the DJ motion when you can't even see me. Oh, museum now been seen it for the third time. Yeah, I'm sorry. I love the stage that much. Anything's off for the new Splooshomatic. Awesome. Okay, I I shouldn't say awesome because that has really crappy range. I do like, but I, I do love the damage on this and the, the fire rate, despite it being shitty short. Oh well. Oh, uh, I nearly botched that jump there. I gotta be super careful when making that jump. Oh, missile, 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 missile! Gotta dodge the missile, the missile, the. I, I shouldn't even get into that. Damn it! Oh well. <clears throat> at least to me that. At least to me, my made-up lyrics are um better than the original Peter Pan. Like, I gotta be completely honest here, I don't really care all that much for, like, musicals or musical numbers in, um, any, uh, in a lot of movies. Don't get me wrong, sometimes, like, musicals do work. I don't find myself too into them anymore. Oh, got jazz music! I'm mostly a metalhead. <laughs> Okay, 
Actually, why did I pick this Pusho Matic? I, you know what? I'm gonna go against what I said here, and I'm and I'm gonna. Um, I'm gonna pick a fourth weapon, going against what I said here. And I know which, just what weapon to use next. Oh, Sema! Like the Samur Kingdom? <laughs> okay, I have to. Just like that moment in Super Mario was like by far the darkest moment in the game. It's like you get to that world so close to destruction and like you end up failing. You see just what everything is like should the count succeed. Just walking through a world where just nothing exists. No corpses left behind. The sky is gone. Nothing remains. Playing that... Seeing that for the first time, I actually shed a tear. But enough of that. <clears throat> okay, was it just me, or did that hat look like a fedora? Oh, and for the record, wearing a fedora does not make you a bad person. I don't know where that myth came from, but it's stupid. Final weapon! You know, I haven't got a chance to use a slashing machine yet, so I'm gonna do it. And yeah, that kind of does look blood red. What the crap? Nintendo, you're getting in touch with your dark side. Or is that just my m dark mind talking? <laughs> Two days. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You! And for, for Christ's sake, how many times have I seen the name Dad? Uh, I've seen that name so many times, like... Okay, we got Dad, whatever. Uh, yeah. The sloshing machine! I... Love this thing. It's it's not like the best for spreading ink. It's more so meant to be an assault weapon. Like, okay, you care about um, the kill-death ratio, or you just want to get a lot of kills racked up? This is the weapon for you. It's, well, sends a shot that's pretty much... It's, uh, it's, it's a small shot that's kind of a tr mini terminator, I guess? It sends many shots, that's kind of what it does. And, here's the thing. It's got <clears throat> more mobility than the, um, tri slasher, if I recall correctly. Um, I'll do an on-screen comparison to the, um, tri slasher in case I'm wrong. But, that's just what it seems like. If that's the case, why is a, um, washing machine... More versatile than the tri slasher. I, I don't get it. That, that's pretty much what this weapon is. A washing machine converted in <clears throat> into a weapon. <laughs> I gotta say, I love it. It's a good quote-unquote bucket. Because that's, that's technically the weapon class. It's a bucket. But, I... Prefer sticking to the um, slasher deco, my favorite weapon. And to, and, and to think, I, I actually call that weapon's existence as hard as I is gonna be to believe, considering I didn't make that prediction known. 
Uh, some you can just kind of argue me like, uh, no, you didn't. Uh, you would have said that in a video. Or, okay, if you really predicted that weapon, why didn't you just say that before? Like, kind of did, but oh well. I'm just going to leave that up to debate. Ah, gotcha! Yeah! There goes my assault weapon! My assault bucket, I should say. That's what I'm going to call this thing from now on. The assault bucket. That is, if I ever, as, if I ever get to using it again. Odds are I may use it in my next Splatoon video. <laughs> I, um, I don't know when that's going to be. But I'm, I'm going to be taking a break from making the Splatoon videos in favor of my um, Octo Valley LP. Whoa, hi. How's it going, missile? Yeah, that's a missile. Like, I'm, I'm just pretty weird. Ah, gotcha! Last minute assassination! Too bad I already got that trophy. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? By 1%! Are you kidding me? What? By 1%! Shut up, PSN Trophy. Ugh. Well, after that epic loss, great! Uh, Mario Fan Girl, you're gonna be laughing your head off at this. I just not. Uh. Seriously, Mario Fan Girl, I love you. End of video. But, uh, yeah, that was Burger vs. Pizza. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Thank you for watching. Pals, signing out. Peace. Oh, and uh, Nintendo, next Black Fest. Bionis vs. Mechanis. Make it happen. Xenoblade needs more representation. Thank you.